it's Maria. How are you doing? I had the coolest idea. So yesterday I did a video on um, how to find your ideal client and we did a meditation around that and I hope you found it helpful. If you didn't see it yet, then go back and find that video. I've linked it in the description below. And you know, I was doing mine again. I've already done this exercise a few times, but I was doing it again and getting even more clear and I had like light bulb moment. I was so happy. So here's what I'm going to do. I am going to, I got my ideal client. I got him like all in my head. The vision is clear. I know what they look like. I know what their names are. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a vision board all about my ideal client. I'm going to put their picture on it, the picture of their home, the picture of them being successful, everything. And I'm going to stick it up on my wall right in front of my computer so that every time I create a piece of content from now on, I can write to that person. This is an excellent idea and I hope you do it too. So all you have to do is do the meditation from yesterday, really get clear on your ideal client, and then go to the internet and find pictures that represent that person. It doesn't have to just be one person, it can be several people because usually our ideal client spans, you know, different groups, different races, different um, genders. So it's not just like one person, but find people that represent different aspects of it. You know, one thing that I did is I found a picture of somebody holding out a credit card, like I'm going to pay you right now. That's important. I need to get paid. I found a picture of somebody sitting in a computer and they were like smiling and they were excited. And I'm like, yes, they're excited about what I have to offer. I found people who were in the age bracket that I was looking for. And I even gave them names. Some of the names were like Joe Determined. He's determined to succeed. Mary, I've got this. She's got it. She's going to figure it out. Sammy's success is going to be successful. You know, I gave them funny little names like that and I stuck them right on top of their pictures so I could remember who they were. <laughs> And now it's like on my wall and I'm going to be writing and talking and conversing and connecting with those people, my ideal clients. So if you've been struggling in your business, you're not getting the sales, then go back. There are three other videos in this series. Go back and watch them all. Do the meditation. Do the exercise. Figure out who your ideal client is and then make yourself a vision board. Make yourself a vision board and stick it up to your wall and make it about your ideal client so that you can talk and write and engage it directly with that person. And I guarantee you that if you do that in a short period of time, your marketing materials are going to improve, they're going to become more targeted, and you're going to start having a lot more successes. That's it for now. Thanks for watching. And I will see you in the next video. Peace out. Okay, a little update here. So after I made that other video, I was so excited that I sat right down on my computer and finished making my vision board. So I want to show it to you real quick. I don't know if you can see it. It's, I'm going to hold it up to the computer right here. And you see I have all sorts of people um, on my vision board. And I put captions. Like I put they're ready and willing and able to buy. And here I put... They're excited and ready to take action. I have paying for college, just got so much easier. I have some houses, which is kind of like the, um, you know, the economic class that represents the economic class. I have all sorts of people and I gave them funny names. Like this is Mary, I've got this, takes her daughters on a dream vacation. And this one says, Darla Dreamer plans her next vacation. And Joe and Kathy Confident can't wait to get started. So you can do any version of this. I did it on the computer, but you could just like print out, um, print out pictures and paste them on a poster board or whatever works for you. But the thing is you want people or you want a representation of your target audience so that you can um, really look at it. I'm going to stick this right on the wall here. It's on top of my calendar. I'll stick it somewhere else so that it's right in front of my computer and 
I can just look at it and think about who I'm writing to when I'm writing my emails, when I'm doing my follow-ups, making my opt-in pages, making videos, any type of marketing, I can use this picture as kind of a template and to remind myself of who I am actually targeting. So that's just a little update to the rest of the video that I did a few minutes ago. Um, I hope you like this. I hope you make your own. And as always, I wish you all the success in the world.